Yeah, well, I guess I just uh, thought... I mean, it would have to be simple. Once in a while, you'd think once in a while this thing would be... I want forensics to take this place apart, man. You, you shred this carpet if you have to. If, if there's any evidence that my baby was here, I want to see it in my own face. Got it. Driver's license. There's no wallet. There's no passport. There's nothing. Look at this. Clear. Mm -hmm. Sandra. There was someone else in this room with Katherine. Adriana? No. It was an evil presence. It was the person who murdered Katherine. What's going on? Please! Step inside the room, please. Now, who are you? I'm the manager. I saw you. Don't even think about it, pal. What's your name? Barton. Leo Barton. Barton. I'm Inspector Castillo with the Santa Barbara PD. Hey, I've been here for 16 years. I've never had any trouble. I, sorry we had to frighten you. I want to ask you a couple of questions about the woman who's been staying in this room. Uh, that'd be Miss Wilson. Do you have a registration card? Uh, yeah, I do, but uh, it won't help you any. Why not? Well, she said she was in between apartments. Uh, there's no fixed address. How did she pay? Cash. Would it be too much trouble to get a list of her phone calls? Uh, she didn't get any. She didn't make any. Now, how do you know so much about her without looking at your records? Well, she's kind of pretty. I drove her around a couple of times. Where? I dropped her off once at a nightclub downtown. Uh, I can't remember his name. That would be the lair? Yeah, that's it. And where else did you take her? I let her out on State Street in front of the courthouse. I don't know where she went from there. She never said anything about where she was going or where she was from? No. She never said a word the whole time we were driving around. Oh, she was polite. She'd say thank you, and if I said it was a beautiful day, she'd nod and agree, but that's it. With that accent she has, I think she doesn't understand English very well. And what kind of accent did she have? French, I think. She in some kind of trouble? Not anymore. Somebody killed her. So you've been on duty all evening? Yeah, I had to go out for about an hour, about seven. I think she was still here when I left. And did you see anyone else in the area? Oh, not a soul. All right, you can go. I'd appreciate it if you'd keep yourself available in case we have any more questions. Yes, sir. Uh... I'm out the door. Yeah, we'll be in touch. Well, I think you've been through enough for one night, so I'm going to have Ramon take you home, if that's okay. Where are you going? To the lair. Thanks. I seem to know everything about this nanny except who killed her. There are a lot of other things I don't know about her. Yeah, but you can see into the future, right? Sometimes. Why won't you tell me what kind of future you can see with uh, you and Castillo? I'll wait in the car.
Hey, Cruz, how's it going? What can I get you? Uh, I can give you some information, TJ. You ever seen this woman? Why? What how happened to her? She was murdered tonight. Murdered? Yeah, she's just been passing through town. So I'm checking the bars in the area. You can't make her? No, I haven't seen her. I mean, I hope you find whoever did that to her. We will. Okay, get in here for you, man. It's gonna be on the house. Um, no, no thanks. I'm, I'm working. I'll take a look at you. See you. All right. See you later. seen her. I'll check back later when the shifts change, but I don't expect any leads. Well, she didn't even talk to the motel manager. It's probably not very likely she'd talk to anyone else, is it? Nope, but we just, we, you know, we'll have to make sure. Uh, that'll be Eden, so you'll excuse me, okay? I've got something to go upstairs. Okay. Ah, baby. Well, I knew it'd be you. No, I just walked in the door. How you doing? <laughs> really? Yeah, I bet Gay Paris has never seen the likes of you and Kelly. No, not yet. I don't I don't know what to say except someday this will uh, it'll become apparent what I've been doing and it'll seem worthwhile. Yeah, well, I feel like a piece of me is missing, too. This is not going to go on forever. I love you, too. we got to keep affording this. I, I, the sound of your voice is what gets me to sleep at night. Well, don't you worry. When we get back together, we'll make up for lost time.